Hey, it's Billy. And it's Pat. And, and we, we like, like to, to live, live outside the box. Box. <laughs> outside of it. This video is being sponsored by our friends at Firefox. They reached out to us and they said, hey, you guys seem like you're not afraid to take chances, to take risks. Uh, can you talk to your audience a little bit about why you do that and, and what you get out of it? And we said, okay. Sure. Well, if anybody has been watching our lives, it would be you guys and seeing what we've been up to, whether it was our wedding, moving, we always tend to have a moment where we have to take a big jump. The most recent thing that's probably gone on in our lives is when Pat decided to start his own company. I did! <laughs> ah, I started my own business a few months ago. My company is called PSN Creative. Oh. Creative name. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, and I'm doing content development and video production and social media strategy and casting and that kind of stuff uh, for small businesses and individuals. But it was kind of a, a, a long thing. I thought about it for a long time of sort of leaving the nine to five or the traditional nine to five and stepping outside of the box and like, I'm going to do something that is risky, but just feeling like, okay, now is the time and I'm ready. We take big leaps, but we always think a little bit before we do it. And that kind of happened the same way with this whole job scenario. Mm -hmm. You kind of went through those lists and tried to figure out like, what is my goal in life? What do I want to take a risk on? What's worth taking a risk on? Mm -hmm. Is this a risk I even want to take? I get agitated when people think that we're impulsive and not thinking. Yeah. Because we're very cautiously caring about the choices that we make. Yeah. And I don't find like our decision to move to Buffalo when people think like why would you move there or mm -hmm. like what why did you make that decision it's like they, I think they don't think that we're gonna have a good answer yeah and like we have good answers for all the ch life choices that we've made but they are leaps they are jumps they are things that a lot of people maybe wouldn't necessarily think to do mm -hmm. but that I feel is what at times could elevate our future a bit, yeah. you know? I mean, one of the things um, like in this Firefox campaign is about not living by like the default, like the things that you feel like you're supposed to do because that's what you do and that's what everybody does. And so everybody likes that. that, so everyone does that. Does everybody like that though? Or does everybody just do that because everybody does that? Yeah. Um, I think that's a, just in general, like in life, in a, many different scenarios, getting over the fact of doing something that goes against the norm is is challenging. And I think we're speaking in kind of like vague terms because it applies to so many different situations, but I think it's so helpful to find someone to like bounce your ideas off of and share what you're scared of and and you know get other people's opinions not to Well you you, you have all these friends now that all took jumps too. Yeah. And you all meet up and you all get together and like brainstorm and yeah. like figure things out because you have to f surround yourself with like-minded people because you'll have to lift each other up. I think when I really think about it, like I'm not the most like risk-taking person, but we make some big jumps. But one of them was when we got engaged, which I didn't really mm. even think about. Oh, you did. Okay, you did. It was, you surprised me. I did. And it wasn't, I won't say that it was like an impulse decision to get engaged, but we went on this trip. You can watch the video of how we got engaged, but uh, like we went on this trip and I was like, I think... I think it's time. I think I want to marry Billy. I think I want to ask him to marry me. I think I'm going to do it on this trip that we're on, but I'm just going to wait and f like feel it. Like I'm a big believer in like you you know when something is oh, the right thing to do. That led you to proposing to me. That led us our feelings led us to moving to Buffalo mm -hmm. and leaving New York City. Mm -hmm. Our feelings led us or you to like make the decision to start your own business. Mm -hmm. And those are all risks. I could have said no when you yeah. tried to propose. Sure could have. You definitely wouldn't have, but you <laughs> could have. <laughs> we got to say thanks again to Firefox for sponsoring this video, uh, for asking us to, to, to make something about this topic. It's really fun. If you guys have any stories you want to share with us about the time you took a risk or did something outside of the box or took a chance on something, leave them in the comments and we'll respond uh, to as many of them as we can. Okay guys, we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye. Hey, it's Billy. And it's Pat. <laughs> hey, it's Billy. And it's Pat. And, and we, we like to live outside the box. Cha cha heels. <laughs> cha cha heels got me. <laughs> Three, two. Wait, 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 wait. Do no, but it's making a smile. It's good. I know. Three, <laughs>